Now, how do you explain the multiverse to an average person? I once asked Steve Weinberg, Nobel laureate, to explain the multiverse in a simple way. And he said, well, look, take a look at radio. If you walk into your living room, how many radio stations are there in your living room? Hundreds of radio stations, right? But your radio is only tuned to one frequency. Okay, it resonates at one frequency, and that's why you hear only one station. But how many stations are there in principle in your living room? Hundreds of vibrations, okay? Now replace the radio with electrons. The electron is a wave, a wave governed by quantum mechanics, okay? And how many waves are there of these electrons? An infinite number of waves, just like infinite number of radio waves. But you are tuned to one frequency. That's why you exist with parallel universes. In your living room, there are dinosaurs. In your living room, there are pirates. In your living room, there are aliens. You don't have to go into outer space to see the aliens. The aliens are there right there in your living room. The thing is, you are no longer vibrating in unison with them. You've bifurcated. So you cannot jump into these other universes unless, of course, you are an electron. Electrons do this all the time. Okay, and what is that called? That's called electronics.